America, I still can hear your song. <coughs> oh my God. But I'm rusty. <laughs> Hello, everyone. The first video excerpt that you have seen was actually on 2002 when I toured as part of the Air Force's premier entertainment showcase, Tops in Blue. I was actually thinking of how to start this week's vlog and remembered my Tops in Blue tour with Sp Spirit of America as the theme. Thank goodness to at Firedrum75 on YouTube for downloading that footage. And those sequins, Ooh, love and miss those blinged out outfits. <laughs> Shout out to all my Tops in Blue brothers and sisters, especially to my TIB 2002 family. This week, we will be talking about another relevant and timely social and cultural issue, diversity and inclusion, and how it relates to the documentary I am producing. As always, I will be showing you some video excerpts from various sources and tie them all in together in a nice bow. Follow Lead Love's brief synopsis is about a queer person of color and an aging female Broadway veteran who joined forces to once and for all help break the barriers of the ballroom world's male as lead and female to follow while realizing its parallelism to our current cultural and social climate. Abdiel and Christine are our main subjects and tackle the subtleties of diversity and inclusiveness both on and off the dance floor. America is a country of diversity and each and every American should take pride on that. On a global scale, I would like to segue you to another video excerpt courtesy of ABC and Academy Awards. If you have seen the recently held Oscar, you know that the winner of Best Picture is the first film not in English language. I felt such pride being from an Asian descent. Oscar goes to Parasite. <laughs> Parasite has six Academy Award nominations and is the first film not in the English language to win Best Picture, winning four Oscars tonight. Congratulations once again to the cast and crew of the movie Parasite. Going back to our main subjects, Christine and Abdiel, they also made history. They are America's first male and female professional ballroom dancers who competed as a gender-neutral couple in a dance sport ballroom competition. They equally shared the power and responsibilities of a follower and a leader. They are the first in the nation. As an immigrant from the Philippines, I am extremely honored to be producing a film about one of America's first. I am making my contribution to the true and optimistic essence of the American dream, offering my share to the fabric of diversity and inclusiveness through film. As a Filipino American, it is such a transcending and exciting way to be producing this project. Imagine yourself being a part of a movement that tackles diversity and inclusion through film. Become a part of follow, lead, love movement with two great options. Make your tax-deductible contributions via Fractured Atlas, fiscal sponsorship 501c3, link on bio, description, and below. Or become one of our investor partners. Email me at followleadlove at transcendence.com or call or text me at 1240-601-6798 for further information as far as the return on investment and provide you the Follow Lead Love's film business proposal for your review. Speaking of collaboration, we are also ongoing in terms of accepting proposals on collaborative fundraising projects and events to benefit your relevant and important causes. The next Two video excerpt, excerpts are courtesy of Ad Council entitled Love Has No Labels and TV Denmark entitled All That We Share. Yeah. The gist of the next two video excerpts is about love, compassion, empathy, and understanding. Two strong, 
powerful videos that really tackle diversity and inclusion across age, gender, sexuality, social and economic status, race, religion, and even politics. The message, it is not about us against them, but as a collective, we, we are more similar than different. It's easy to put people in boxes. There's us, and there's them. The high earners, and those just getting by. Those we trust, and those we try to avoid. The people from the countryside, and those who've never seen a cow. The religious, and the self-confident. There are those we share something with, and those we don't share anything with. Velkommen. Jeg kommer til at stille jer nogle spørgsmål i dag. Nogle af dem kan godt være lidt personlige, men jeg håber, I vil svare ærligt på dem. Hvem herinde i rummet var klassens klog? And then suddenly, there's us. We who believe in life after death. We who've seen UFOs. And all of us who love to dance, we who've been bullied, and we who've bullied others. We who are broken-hearted. We who are madly in love. We who feel lonely. We who are bisexual, and we who acknowledge the courage of others. We who have found the meaning of life, and we who have saved lives. So maybe, there's more that brings us together than we think. TV2 Denmark. All that we share. The title of this documentary is such an appropriate title to encapsulate the real essence of this project. Love has no labels. That love for dance is an art form that should resonate without any labels or demarcation attached to it. Our main subjects wanted to respect the time-honored past of ballroom dancing and help usher it to an optimistic, more inclusive, and brighter future. Can they do it? Next video excerpt is courtesy of Apple entitled Inclusion and Diversity. I love the fact that it emphasized the concept that our differences make us stronger if we just learn how to humanize it. Open. Open a door and it opens all the others. Open a mind and see what happens next. No great thing, no beautiful invention was created in a vacuum. It happens when we leave our comfort zone and come together. Embrace faiths, cultures, disabilities, differences. Embrace races, ages, ideologies, personalities. Humanity is plural, not singular. The best way the world works is everybody in, nobody out. So who we're made of is everyone. Differences not just celebrated, but essential. Many more women in charge. Equal pay for equal work everywhere.
more diverse than the one that came before. Open is not just who we are, but what we believe as a company. Because humanity isn't singular, it's plural. The truth is, we don't see things the same. The power is, we don't see things the same. We should always be mindful that as we become more connected, more accessible to each and everyone on a global scale, now more than ever, diversity and inclusion are two vital and very important aspects of our daily lives. That regardless of who you are, we need to work together to create a more accepting and tolerant world. That following and leading should be of, of equal opportunity to everyone, everywhere, anywhere. For love is love and diversity and inclusion should be a collective effort across the human spectrum. Once again, thank you so much for tuning in. Please don't forget to comment, share, like, follow, and subscribe. Also, encourage everyone you know on making a tax-deductible contribution to complete this project or become one of our investor partners like you. Let them know that there is an opportunity for them to be an active participant to a meaningful and significant project. No amount is too small to contribute or to invest. I would like to end this video blog with another excerpt from my Top Simlu 2002 tour. Much gratitude and I'll see you again. As you have seen here tonight, America's music and spirit uphold great melting pots of diversity. America has opened her arms to embrace immigrants from around the world. The courage of these people who continue to journey here to fulfill their dreams still provides the foundation upon which this nation exists. Everywhere around the world, they're coming to America.